Community Season 1, Episode Number 3. Ladies and gentlemen, we're here to next week's episode of Community. And by God almighty, you guys already know I'm super excited for it, man. Nice little switch up on the schedule. Just kind of a show to kick back, watch, and laugh at, man. And that's what I love about it. Last week's episode, Pierce and Jeff presented their project together. And I mean, I guess you could say it went kind of well. Depends on how you look at it, but that was funny as fuck. We obviously had the kind of silent protest going on as well and Pierce come out and make a scene and everything like that. But I love to see the relationships continue to grow between everybody, between Jeff and Britta, between, you know, him and Pierce, between Abed, just continuing to build everything, continuing to build up the story and stuff. But guys, I'm gonna stop wasting time. We're gonna go ahead, we're gonna hop into this episode. Before we do, I do ask if you guys are new to channel, you do hit that subscribe button, comment down below what you guys want to next, man. Drop a like on the video for your boy. For reaction, it'll be up on Patreon as well as early access in the next two episodes. If you guys wanna check that out, link in the description down below. But we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna hop into this episode. Death, so called, is a thing that makes men weep. What class is this, bro? No tests, no papers. You want an A? Live in the moment. Mm. Sign me up for this fucking class. You could die in your sleep. You could get hit by a bus. You, that mole is raised and dark. It's not a good combo. You are new. Yes, I am new, but I'll be old too soon. Or carpe diem. He's happy as fuck, man. I like it. He said, as long as I ain't gotta do shit. Voice command. Voice command. <sighs> Voice command. Yeah. <clears throat> Just clear your throat. Voice command. Would you please use the buttons? Okay, Grandpa. <laughs> what the fuck? Was that a real sneeze? What the fuck, Troy? My God. My dad will only pay for classes that will help me run the family restaurant. Eh? It's been struggling since 2001. 9-11 was pretty much the 9-11 of the falafel business. So your dad has- Jesus. Are you even interested in falafel? I'm interested in making movies, but my dad says all media is Western propaganda that negatively stereotypes Arabs. Mm -hmm. How much does a film class cost? Seventy dollars. Britta. Jeff. <laughs> She's gonna pay for it for him. You're not as understanding as Christians. You can get your head cut off with a salami sword. <laughs> Surely. <laughs> she say a salami sword? What the fuck? <laughs> Jesus, hey, Troy, Troy like what? a girl. Yeah. And how about I pound you like a boy? That didn't come out right. <laughs> that didn't, bro. Pause. You're not my mother. She's not? What? 29 seconds. Jesus Christ, man. Pierce, I, I believe Pierce really thought that was his mom, to be honest. I could see that. Oh, you love to see it, man. I, I love how they just play into all the stereotypes so fucking well in this show, man. Fucking Pierce and is speaking into the phone. I swear to God. My dad does the same shit. Now, granted, he has an iPhone, so it works better than that, but. Why did the pretty young girl die alone, surrounded by sweater-wearing cats who are trained to use human toilets? Get up on your desk. Jeff is loving this shit, man. She made it! <laughs> Everyone, stand on your desks! Up, 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 come on! Well, why not? Shit, I was gonna say, somebody might fucking fall. That's why not. It's okay, go to the nurse. Seize the day. Uh, he said, get the fuck out of my class. I want you to swim in a lake and tell 10 people that you love them. Not swimming in a lake. Funny enough, I am going to the lake today. It's 90 fucking degrees. Not to swim for me, but so my dogs can swim. <laughs> I like to think that every life that passes through this class is changed. But every year, there's always one cocky opportunist who's just here to coast. Oh, yeah. Jeff. His name is Pierce. <laughs> I, I can die. If you don't genuinely seize the day, before the end of the week, then you will be seizing an F for the mm. semester. Damn. He's this like, is no way to teach accounting! <laughs> He's like, but, but you said we pass. <laughs> hey, how's it going? How's your film class, Is this buddy? a bed? It's cool. Yep. Our first assignment is a documentary. They're like real movies, but with ugly people. You want to get involved in my family's business? Oh shit. Holy. War. Where <laughs> Holy I war. Mr. Beta? I love women, but I'm getting a major B-word vibe from you. <laughs> you go host American Idol and you stop messing with my son. He's a special Damn. boy. Dreams are for sleeping. You don't know that. It's clinically proven. <laughs> <Stop>. <laughs> Anna, what does the have? Wait, what is he saying? He says we're leaving. 
Uh, you're dumb that you want to stay and study film. I don't think I'm really in the scene. Let's hey, go. Hey, hey, Jim. <laughs> Brit about to throw you down. Got that Look at her. <laughs> I don't know what kind of form that is. You want to raise him? You raise him. I'm out. Mm. Wait, what? You know. He's got to live with him. Jeff, I think you should play the role of my father. <laughs> I don't he's, be your father. I, I think he's about to. Lines. Oh my god, dude. Why are you dressed like an 80s rapist? <laughs> Professor Women comes by here every morning. Seize the day. Is that a new camera? Yeah, it's more expensive, but it lets me adjust really specific settings that most people don't notice or think about. Yeah. <laughs> hey, that's facts sometimes, bro. People be going out of the way buying the most expensive camera to make these YouTube videos and shit. Change these little tiny details. And most of the time you can't even tell. I shall have a birthday cake. What? Oh my god, dude. Imagine sneezing like that. Oh, Troy, bro, you gotta hold it in, man. You gotta learn to hold your sneeze in. No, those are both for me. Ah. I can help you with your image. First, I lose the jacket and you look like a high school bitch. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Draw them in, sneeze, you know. <laughs> then maybe I wouldn't sneeze. He's faking it. <laughs> I think I, I think the Cubs are gonna win all this year. What the fuck? That wasn't no sneeze. What do you think? <laughs> His face. Tell me more. Bro, you can learn to hold your sneeze in too. Just <laughs> something like that, you know. But goddamn, I ain't never heard somebody sneeze like Troy. <laughs> hey everybody, good morning. Good morning, sir. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> He's not impressed. Thank you guys. Bring it in here. Nice. Eh? You guys, that was really fun. Bro, those old ass jump ropes. Sloppy. And considering the age of these girls, unwittingly creepy. Damn it. Yeah, that is true. He paid them to be set up. Go running naked in a hailstorm, kiss a girl in the middle of the day, fly a kite, uh, but do it for yourself. Or you won't just fail my class. You'll fail life. You'll fail life. <laughs> Right there, Jeff. There's your moment. Kiss Britta. <laughs> seize the day. Will you please talk to him? I've got problems of my own. I'm out here trying to seize a day. Yeah. Look, he's recording him. <laughs> what the hell? What the fuck? <laughs> Is he gonna kill us? <laughs> That's what it fucking looks like, bro. Oh my god. Pizza, Abed. I was starving. Yeah, it's nice. Like a, like a picnic. Or a family dinner. It's a study group and a pizza. Let's not get carried away. <laughs> Don't get your fucking hopes up, Pierce. Dude, he even eats pizza weird. Pierce, what the fuck? So, Abed, how's film class? Good. Someone order seven lattes. I got that. No. He's from Breaking Bad! I got it, Abed. I got everything. What is wrong with you? All I want to do is take care of you. I know you're not stupid. Are you doing this on purpose? It what the fuck is wrong with you, Pierce? Maybe you're, Maybe Pierce is stupid. <laughs> Bro, that delivery dude was from Breaking Bad. He played Jesse's friend, right? Yeah. The helicopter bitch. What do you think, Dad? I think you are really weird, Abed. And I think the wrong person just left. Yeah. He's like, I'm out too. Have you met Abed? You know who he is? Guys. Yes, I you know. Have guys, guys. You are I'm finished. Uh, God, let's see it. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? I don't want to be your father. Yeah. <laughs> hey, the motion tracking is not bad. <laughs> what is wrong with you? All I want to do is take care of you. Yeah. <laughs> Why will you not answer me? <laughs> it's so sad, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think you are weird, Abed. Mm, his mom had divorced him. person just left. Uh, is that what it is? His wife. Uh, Cool of bed films. It's not exactly Citizen Kane. Uh, he loves it. <laughs> oh. Were they arguing? His parents. Over him, and then his wife left. His son is hard to understand. If making movies help him be understood, then I pay for the class. Mm. There you go. With falafel as a fallback. <laughs> Plan B. 
Did you do all of that to me on purpose? That's not a very nice way to treat your friends. It, well, Britta, it isn't called friend business. It's called show business. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> what? <laughs> the fuck? Thank you. That was no. Um, you should kiss me right now. The professor's watching. Carpe diem. Day seized. We're even. Eh, yep. A plus, winger. I know a life-changing kiss when I see one. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, fuck the class. Brennan, come back. <laughs> you. This motherfucker out here climbing the tree, bro. <laughs> He's that professor. Am I crumping? No. Am I crumping? No. Am I crumping? No. Am I crumping now? You look like you're having a seizure. This is crumping. <laughs> we're, we're crumping. No, you're not. Oh God, he's gonna do it. <laughs> oh my God, dude. Oh, Community Season 1, Episode 3 is in the books, ladies and gentlemen. Carpe diem, bitch. She's the motherfucking day. What an episode, man. I love this show more and more the more I watch it, dude. I will admit, though, this is a show I wish I was just kind of binging a little bit, you know, throw on at night as I'm kind of relaxing, but I'm happy I'm reacting to it too, because my God, is there some funny fucking moments in this show, dude. I love how they just, all the stereotypes for the characters, they, they, they kind of set them up and they really just, they really go with them, it seems like. I know we're only on episode three, but they set them up on the first episode and they've gone with them throughout these first couple episodes for everybody, for a bed, for Pierce. You know, for Shirley, for Annie and stuff. And I feel like we haven't got a ton of Annie yet. We've got, obviously, we had last episode was a Pierce episode. First episode was kind of everybody being introduced and stuff. This episode was uh, a bed and kind of, you know, more so focused on um, Britta and Jeff, too. I feel like every episode's kind of focused on Jeff, though. I definitely feel like all of them are kind of the main characters in the show. But Jeff is definitely the main, main character, so to speak. But, dude, I, I just, I, I love the comedy in the show, man. It's so funny to see kind of how everybody interacts with each other and interacts with the world. Because, again, it's just a fucking group of people that you wouldn't expect to be friends or be together. You know, you got old people, young people, you know, people from different walks of life and stuff. And they're all in this fucking study group together. And they're all actually friends, you know what I mean? Like, they interact outside of the shit. They actually kind of care about each other a little bit. Now, obviously, that's growing more and more throughout these episodes, but it's just funny to see and kind of funny to see the small problems they have, like fucking Troy with his sneeze. I don't know who the fuck sneezes like that, bro. Now, granted, his, his, his new sneeze is an upgrade, but it's still fucking weird, man. Just hold your sneeze in. You know, I hold my sneezes in, not because my sneeze is weird, but it's just how I've always done it. You know, sometimes I'll let it out and sneeze normally, but... I mean, most of the time I just hold them in. I'm just like, hey, hey. and people tell me, like, oh, you know, some shit can happen. Yeah, you know, some shit happens, it happens. But regardless, man, another dope episode in the books. Funny ass show. I'm glad this is the one we started because I'm fucking loving it. But guys, let me know what you thought about it in the comment section down below. Like always, also, if you guys did enjoy this reaction video, make sure to leave a like if you guys are new to the channel. Hit that subscribe button for reaction to be up on Patreon as well as early access to the next two episodes. If you guys want to check that out, link in the description down below. I hope you all have a wonderful day. And I'll see you in the next one. What is going on, everybody? I hope you guys all did enjoy that video you just checked out. If you did, make sure to drop a like and comment down below. What is movie or TV series that you guys would like to see me react to next? I want to give a couple quick shout outs to some of my highest tier supporters over on Patreon, man. Shout out to the homie That's So Gordo, the homie Silas Kane, and the homie Alexander Collins. I appreciate your guys' insane support, man. If you guys want to join the Patreon family, link is on screen right now as well as in the description down below. I hope you guys all have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next one.